What's going on guys, it's your boy Fox here and today I'm actually bringing you a theory upon the giant, uh, the bonus zombies map if you pre-order the, I believe it's the hardened edition or better and um, so yeah you get the giant map and there's a lot of things inside this map that people don't pick up on and I'm going to pick up on them and give my opinion on what they could potentially be in this video today so I'll let the clip roll for you guys and I'll see you in a second. Okay, so what we saw there was actually World War II Richthofen bringing back World War I Richthofen and as you can see, World War I Richthofen which is on the left, he's the younger one and World War II on the right which is the older one, of course. But, World War II one, he was a bit more insane and he would do anything to make sure he had the power whereas obviously, what you think about it and you go, right, World War I one World War One Rick Coffin, he wouldn't be as power hungry, but he'd want power to a certain extent. So what you begin to think then is actually is World War One Rick Coffin a better thing for the storyline or is it a worse thing? Is he gonna do more bad things? Is he gonna I don't know, take control of something, wanna be the one in power, wanna I don't know, be the leader of the zombies, as we know, so well, we can't particularly say this sort of thing, but the next photo I'll be bringing up will show you something pretty key to what I think the zombie storyline for the giant will include. What we see here is actually World War One Richthofen, the younger Richthofen, uh, grabbing something from the World War Two older Richthofen's body. But what would he want to grab? Uh, accolades? That's about it, really. That is on Richthofen's body, but. Something we definitely know it's not is a gun. World War One Richthofen has a gun because he just shot World War Two. Older Richthofen, he shot his older self because he doesn't want this older self. He wants a younger self. And I mean, this could be so he lives for longer. But as we're now going to see, I'll bring up a picture of World War Two Richthofen uh, a bit bigger on the screen. What is there actually on him here? Uh, we've got the black thing. Uh, what's that? Telecom, maybe? That's about the only thing that could possibly be. Uh, you've got the accolades obviously on the neck, uh, the accolade on his uh, the on uh, his left pectoral, and then that's about it really that's on that side of his body, because as we see, that's the side he's found on. There's nothing I could really understand that is there, but I'll zoom in a bit more onto that photo. Zoom in a bit more, we don't actually see that much different to what we saw when it wasn't that zoomed in. But something you can focus on here, Treyarch are being yet again very, very clever with what they've done. They have shadowed the part of his arm where the younger Rick Coffin, younger himself, is grabbing something from. So, this is there something on that arm that we've missed? Is some they've covered up from the cutscene? Uh, we don't know. But I will. Read you a bit of the cutscene in a second, so back in a second. Okay, so I'm going to read a bit from the cutscene, and this is the bit that you, the cutscene is the bit you see at the start of the video bit that you saw at the start. So basically, Dempsey says to Richthofen, Damn it, Richthofen, I thought you were done with this. Then, rather than replying straight away to the new Richthofen, the World War II, the World War One Richthofen, checks the World War II Richthofen's corpse and that's actually been written in the like, sort of subtitle bit for this and then you have World War One Richthofen say what can I say Dempsey things change and then Nicola replied said only a fool would dare to change history so it ch is what Richthofen has done here completely screwed over time or has it just done nothing in fact is it just are they just now going to be stuck in this time lapse just infinite time, no time going by, nothing's going to happen to him, just zombies after zombies after zombie. Or has he changed history? But 
world, but this World War One recover and said, I'm no fool. What I do, I do only to secure a better tomorrow. So, has he done this, or are they just playing with us? Our try out just gonna be playing with us and saying, just secure a better tomorrow. So if you look at several pictures of the clock in the cutscene, you see they're all on a different time. Uh, there's actually one at the start, I believe, where it's on like half past three. Then you have the one where um, the World War One Rick Hoffman's actually being brought back. At that one, it's actually on three o'clock. So when they go backwards in time, and it's completely fucked up the time system, or has something else happened? So we don't know what's happened there, but what we do know is that we now have a younger Rotafin back and could this be better for the zombie cycles, better for the zombie story because as we know the giant is an alternate ending to Origins but we don't know yet hopefully we will find out soon within the coming maps for Black Ops 3 then anyway, I've got another Black Ops 3 video coming out soon uh, actually about Shadows of Evil and a lot of stuff that's within that map so that make sure you watch out for that, that's pretty cool and I've also got the Carrier series coming out of Exo Zombies on Black Ops, not Black Ops, on uh, Ex Advanced Warfare coming up soon. Thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you all next time. Peace.